Good morning, mighty men and women of God. Today is Monday, February 8th of 2021. Have you ever thought that you could go somewhere to escape the presence of the Lord? Since he has created the earth and all that is in it, that would be comparable to playing hide and seek with someone in their own house. There is just no place you can hide where they won't find you. Really, there's just no point in even trying to hide. So today, this morning's prayer acknowledges there is no place we can go to escape the presence of Father God. O oh, Father, you have searched me and you know me. You know when I sit and when I rise. You perceive my thoughts from afar. You discern my going out and my lying down. You are familiar with all my ways. Before a word is on my tongue, you know it completely. O oh, Father, you hem me in, behind and before. You have laid your hand upon me. Such knowledge is just too wonderful for me, too lofty for me to attain. Where can I go from your spirit? Where can I flee from your presence? If I go up to the heavens... You were there. If I make my bed in Sheol, you were there. Father, if I rise on the wings of the dawn, if I settle on the far side of the sea, even there your hand will guide me, your right hand will hold me fast. If I say, Surely the darkness will hide me, and the light becomes night around me. Even that darkness will not be dark to you, Father. The night will shine like the day, for darkness is as light to you. O Father, you created my inmost being. You knit me together in my mother's womb. I praise you because I am fearfully and wonderfully made. Your works are marvelous. That I know so very well. My frame was not hidden from you when I was made in the secret place. When I was woven together in the depths of the earth, your eyes, Father, saw my unformed body. All the days ordained for me were written in your book before one of them came to be. Oh, Father, how precious to me are your thoughts. How vast is the sum of them. Search me, Father and know my heart. Test me, and know my anxious thoughts. See if there is any offensive way in me, and lead me in the way everlasting. Oh, it's in the mighty name of Jesus that I pray this morning, Father. Amen. This is Jeff with this morning's prayer, praying that you have a great and God-filled day today. Shalom.